Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a huge, massive summer clothing haul. I love clothing hauls. They're probably like my favorite video to watch on YouTube. I just love seeing what people buy, what people like, what's their style. I don't know, I just love watching clothing hauls. This is a collective haul. I did not get this all at once. I have gotten this over time because I have quite a bit to show you. Um, I have bathing suits, bags, shoes, jeans, shorts, tops, dresses, all the above. So much to show you. As always, everything will be linked down below in the description box easily for you guys to shop. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe this video so you guys stick around to my channel. And I'm just going to get right into the video because I have so much to show you. And this is going to take very long for me to try all this on and show it to you guys. So let's just get straight into the video. stuff that I don't have to try on yet because I really I just I just filmed another video trying on a ton of pair of jeans and your girl's not really wanting to put on clothes right now so I'm gonna start with the stuff that I don't have to try on first um, so let's go with shoes and bags and accessories so the first pair of shoes that I got were from the brand Chinese laundry I already have these in a taupe color um, I am obsessed with these shoes I think they're so freaking cute and this color especially is perfect for summer it is these booties mules whatever you want to call them um, they're white and I just love wearing white for the summer and they have like a snakeskin pattern on it which I'm just I'm obsessed with these I love these so much. I got these on sale at Von Mauer, which is a department store here in upstate. Um, it's kind of like a Nordstrom. Oh my God, I'm like eating my hair. Um, but I just love these. I got these on sale, so I was like, heck yeah. Um, I already own these in another color and I just love them so much. So I had to pick up this pair because I don't own a pair of like white booties and I know I really wanted one for summer and I can't wait to wear these in Nashville. I think they're gonna be perfect. The next pair of shoes are kind of like a staple for me in the summer. I always just need like a simple pair of sandals. I'm very picky when it comes to my sandals. I don't like too many and I saw these on ASOS for I think like 20 bucks and I just loved them and I bought them. Um, they are kind of beat up because I've been wearing them so much for the, <laughs> the past like couple weeks since I've gotten them. But it's just these pair of like brown sandals right here. I will insert a picture of me wearing them. They're just, they're just so cute to pair with a dress. Very simple. I love just sandals and simple flip flops in the summer sometimes, um, depending on the outfit. But I wear these all the time and they were so freaking inexpensive. So yeah, ASOS. And then lastly for shoes, I'm a Vans girl over a Converse girl. Honestly, I love both, but... Vans are so much more comfy, um, and I already own a, t a couple pairs, um, and I know I wanted these for a really long time. They're so in right now, so I just picked up the black and white old school Vans. I got the original. I just thought these were so cute to wear with like a band tee and a pair of jeans. Um, even this outfit, I always pair it with this outfit. I don't know. They're so comfy, and they're just really great walking shoes and shoes to kind of like beat up and wear around. Um, and my Converse, I need to be thrown out, and they're really not that comfy anyway. Um, so I got these. Got these off the Free People website. Um, they were on sale at the time. I got these 50% off, so I was like, you can't beat that. Okay, now moving on to a bag. I picked up two handbags. Um, this one I found from Forever 21, and one of my favorite designer brands is Chloe. Obviously, I can't afford designer <laughs> or anything luxury because it's balling on a budget. <laughs> but this looks the exact same as the backpack that I want from Chloe, and honestly, I not like it doesn't bother me to have like a knockoff of something. I could care less if it looks the same. Like I'm all for the Fuji. I'm all for that. Um, so I found this bag at Forever 21 for like 20 bucks and I was like, heck yeah, I can get the same exact style for so cheap. So it is this like Chloe lookalike backpack. I love backpacks for the summer. They're just so cute um, and easy to throw like stuff in here and just on the go. So um, it comes with this shoulder strap if you wanted to like put it on your shoulder, but I always just wear it as a backpack. So there are straps in the back and it's just a chloe lookalike i know a t i know i was gonna buy one off of amazon that looked like that too there's a ton of like um fake luxury brands that like look the same but i came across this at forever 21 i was like i can't i can't pass this up so and then the second bag i actually have stuff in here because i like use this every single day of my life it is like my carrying around bag throw all my stuff in it i originally got this for my trip to mexico because i needed like a bag to put all my camera stuff in and i do use this for like when i go shooting for like um, my blog or my Instagram or stuff like that. I like to just throw my tripod and my camera in here. Um, but I love this bag. It is such a great tote bag and it's good for like school and stuff like that. I mean, back to school is a little too early right now, but it is the perfect bag. So I got this from Free People. Um, there's a ton of stuff in here. So what it comes with is just like a huge tote bag, but it also comes with this attached inside, which is great because I put like my lip gloss in here. I have my chapstick because I always lose them and then my keys in here. So I never like they're never lost in the bottom of this bag um so yeah it's just a really great like essential 
tote bag. You can never not need a tote bag. So I got this from Free People. Okay, this wasn't really a need, but um, I have a ton of hats. <laughs> I'm a hat person. Um, but I actually, what I did was I did sell <clears throat> my old hat that I just, it didn't fit me. Um, and I ended up using the money that I got for that to buy this hat. So it kind of worked out in the end because this actually does fit me. Um, this hat is from Free People. It is from the brand of Brooklyn Hat Company. Um, I love this hat so much, A, because it just has the Western feel to it. I love the distrust of the hat. But it also has these, um, like, what do you want to call it? Like, string in here to, like, to, oh my god, what am I trying to say? There's strings in the hat that you can adjust the size of the hat to make it fit you. Um, I just love this hat, A. It's going to look great in Nashville. And two, I just love wearing hats. They're, like, my favorite accessory. Um, but it just fits really, really nicely on my head. Um, the other one just did not fit me correctly and it was kind of pointless to keep it even though it was like a cute hat But I love this hat. I can't wait to wear it and it fits so nicely on my head <sighs> I love hats. Oh, hold up. I forgot a pair of shoes. If you guys did not know I am a Lulu's ambassador So they did send me the two things that I'll be sharing in this haul with you guys from Lulu's um, and one of them is These pair of shoes. I love these shoes and they're gonna go perfect with the dress I'm gonna show you from Lulu's. I think they're so cute and they can easily be paired with the dress to make it more dressy or a pair of jeans because of the, the way that they're, like the style of these heels. I love these so freaking much. I don't really own heels and I'm not really a heel person, but I like to wear them when I'm like trying to dress up, look cute, or go out with like the girls or my boyfriend for like a date night, you know what I mean? Um, so it's always good to have like a nice pair of heels. Um, I love these, they're like the cork style. Um, I just think they're so freaking cute and they're gonna go great with the dress that I picked out. Um, they fit true to size. They were fairly inexpensive. I think they were like 30 something. I'll have it linked down below for you guys. Um, and also there's like a padding right in the foot of like the sole of the shoe. So it makes it super comfortable. They are a little high for me, um, but I think these would look great with a pair of jeans. Um, but I'm just really excited. I think these are so cute. Okay, accessories. So I have picked up a couple necklaces. I'm wearing them right now. Uh, one of the ones I'm gonna show you and then this one right here. I will do close up so you guys can see them. Um, but I have been loving the trend of like the vintage necklaces, like the pendants, um, like kind of like the religious like pendant necklaces. Um, I think they're so freaking cute and I love the style of them. I just love how vintage they are. And I've picked up a couple, um, some places are very expensive and I'm not gonna, I'm not about to drop like $80 on like a trend. So I have found some inexpensive necklaces that are super cute and that look the exact same as the very expensive ones. So the first one I got is from ASOS. Um, it comes with a double chain and it's kind of crossed in the middle to give that like effect. I love the like big chain of this and then there is a pendant in the middle. Um, so I love this one. I think this was $12. Um, it was sold out on and off so I kept on watching the ASOS website and then it eventually came back in stock and I got it. And then lastly I'm wearing these two right here. I got this as a set. Um, there are two different pendant necklaces. One's like a mini one and then one's like a longer one. The, these two together, the set was three dollars. Three dollars. From Shein. Um, I know some people are kind of like, you order from Zaffle or Shein, like it's kind of sketchy, but honestly I've never really had problems with them. Um, it came fairly quickly because it shipped from California instead of overseas. Um, and you can't beat three dollar necklace for two like you know what I mean like that is such a good price Okay, so the first piece of clothing that I'm gonna share with you guys is actually this top right here. Um, I picked it up from urban um, I love this color. I'm so into this color like the millennial yellow. Um, it's just a tube top There is um, like a rubber piece in here to kind of keep it up um, And these are just like a staple for summer. They're so easy to just throw on with a pair of shorts good to go urban the next item of clothing is going to be a dress that is from Lulu's. So I did pick this out and they did send this to me. So thank you, Lulu's. So the next item I'm going to share with you is from the brand Lulu's. Um, I did pick this out and they did send this to me. So thank you so much, Lulu's. I love this dress and I love this color. I'm so into the color yellow lately. I'm, I'm just loving it and I'm here for it. Um, this dress is from the brand Free People, but I got it from Lulu's. I just think it is the cutest thing ever. Like th these little sleeves. I think um, just a flare skirt and in the back, um, it's kind of an open back, but then it ties with like a big bow in the back on like the lower back. I just think it is so cute and this is like the perfect summer dress. Um, I can't wait to style it. Oh, I'm so excited. So the next piece of clothing is actually a denim jumper and I got this um, for my trip to Nashville. I think it's going to go perfect there, but also it is such a great transition piece for the fall time. You can wear it with some tights and then like um, like a turtle, a turtle neck sweater or a sweater underneath. I just thought it was like a perfect item to transition and I love clothing like that because you save your money and you can wear it in a couple seasons. 
Um, so let me fix this. So I'm so excited to wear this Nashville. I think it's so cute. It is a denim jumper. It comes in a couple different colors. It comes in like nude, white, and a couple different blue like denims, but I got it in black because um, I don't own too much black denim. I think this is so cute. Um, I did get it in a size four, which is usually my size. It is a little bit short, um, but that's kind of the style of this jumper. Um, but overall, I really love it, and I can't wait to wear this to Nashville, and also in the fall, I think it's going to be so cute. Like, imagine this with, like, an orange sweater that screams fall. The next piece of clothing is a top, and I got this from Windsor. Um, I have been seeing these types of tops everywhere. It's kind of, like, the style right now. I love this top. Um, it's tied in the front, and then there's, like, an off-the-shoulder, like, puffy sleeves on the side. I just think it's so cute with a pair of denim shorts. Um, I love this top, and I can't wait to wear it to Nashville. Only thing is, it's a little, like, a little revealing on the top, so that's why I kind of have to like really tie it in the front, but that doesn't bother me. I think this top is so cute and perfect like, for a nice night in the summer or even like a date night out. I just think it's so cute. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram so you guys can see my trip to Nashville with my boyfriend, but also see my outfits and how I styled them because I do post a lot of outfits and makeup stuff on my Instagram as well. The next piece I am so in love with. I love the color. I love the top. The only thing is I wish it fit me a little bit better. The only reason why it doesn't fit me as well is because I don't have that big of boobs so it doesn't really like work for me that well but if I wear like a pretty full like strapless bra it looks okay on me I just love it and I think it's so cute um so it is this pink top right here it is from the brand called IMGia but I got it from Urban Outfitters um so it is just like a corset top that you can tuck into a pair of shorts and it's kind of off the shoulder I love this top so much I can't wait to wear this out in Nashville it's also just a perfect top to wear out like um, out to a bar or something like that or a date night like this is such a cute top you can wear it with jeans or a skirt like and I love that it's not super cropped you can still kind of tuck it into a pair of jeans and like you're not really showing that much if you're not feeling it that day um, but I just love the color I think it's so cute the next top is from Revolve and it is specifically the brand called Tularosa um, I wish I could have gotten the skirt to match this because this would have been such a cute outfit but I'm not blowing like $300 on an outfit <laughs> I wish um, but I thought this top would be perfect for Nashville, either the night out or even just a day. I have kind of in mind like what I, where I want to take this picture, like how I want to style it too. I just think it's perfect for Nashville and summer too. Like gingham is so in still and yellow gingham just screams summer. I think it's so cute. So there's like these puppy sleeves. It's kind of cropped. So it looked cute with a pair of shorts. I think it just literally screams like Southern Belle. I don't know. I love this top and I'll wear it, um, even to like a country concert or just summer. You know what I mean? I'll get some use out of it, but I just love this top. Um, so again, it is from the brand Revolve and it is by the brand Tularosa. The last top I'm going to share with you guys is from American Eagle. They kind of, I, they have a lot of band tees, um, but they release, I guess, like a whole, um, like collection of Rolling Stones. I kind of broke my roll. Um, I bought a band tee and I don't listen to the music of the band. And I always would say like, I'll never wear a band tee unless I listen to their music. And I broke my rule because I love this top so much. So maybe I'll have to listen to them just because I don't want to feel like a loser. <laughs> but I picked up this band tee from American Eagle. I got it a size medium to kind of, kind of make it a little bit oversized. I just love this top so much. I picked this up from American Eagle. I got it a size medium because I wanted to be a little bit more oversized, but it has the iconic tongues on there from the Rolling Stones. And I loved it because it just had all the different flags on it. Like I thought this was such a unique, a color, I love this color again, yellow. And two, I just thought it was a unique band tee. I love this so, so freaking much. Pair this with like tied up and pair it with a pair of jeans and my vans. And I just think it's such a cute outfit. Um, but I promise I'll listen to their songs because I just, I feel like such a dork when I wear a band tee and then I don't listen to those songs. And someone's like, oh, you like the Rolling Stones. And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Okay, moving on to bottoms, and then I'll end this haul with some bathing suits. So I got these shorts. Um, I've, I saw these all over Instagram, and I thought they were so freaking cute. Um, I'm going to wear them in Nashville, but also I'm just going to wear these all the time because they're so freaking adorable. Um, I love the paper bag, like pants and shorts trend, um, but sometimes they can make you look like you're a literal paper bag, and I wanted one to like be semi-flattering. Um, so I got these from the brand Storettes. Um, I love these so freaking much. I got them in a size four, no, size small. Um, but when you put them on first, they're like huge, but the whole point of a paper bag is so like you can tighten them so they kind of bunch up. Um, you'll see when I'm styling, when I'm like wearing them and I'm showing you, but I love these so freaking much. Um, perfect like cute denim shorts if you're, if you're not really into the whole like booty short trend. These are just like a great option. Um, and I think they're very flattering for being a paper bag short. 
Um, so yeah, I love these. The last two bottoms are pairs of jeans. Um, I love these so much. I picked these up recently. I don't know which video is gonna go first But I did just before this film a video on all my favorite jeans that make my butt look good So if I post that before this video, I will link it down below I'm not sure which I'm gonna post first, but I will link it down there once I post it anyway for you guys um, But these two jeans will be in there. You guys can see what they look like on. I love these. So one is Moderately priced and the other one is very inexpensive because I got it on sale So I will show you the first pair. These are from the brand BDG. They're like one of my favorite jean brands ever from um, They're from Urban Outfitters BDG is like my go-to jean brand. I think they just fit me so nice. There's so many different styles to choose from um, They have black jeans white jeans flare jeans mom jeans like literally every pair of jeans and they always just look so good on me. So they're like my go-to pair of jeans and they go on sale a lot. So I picked up these jeans from Urban when I went. Um, they are the Mom High Rise um, for reference of style. And I got them in my size 25. So they fit, fit, they fit true to size. What I loved about them was they were still tight around the butt. So they like emphasize and make your curves look really nice. They don't make you look like you're wearing like a potato sack. Um, but they also were loose around like the thighs and the the cab area so they still give the mom feel but they're still very flattering um and sometimes with mom jeans they look a little unflattering on me but i love these and they're very high-waisted and sometimes i just really want a really really high-waisted pair of pants the last pair of jeans um funny story so all the girls i work with every people they literally obsess about madewell jeans and i'm obsessed with madewell jeans too but they're very expensive i think they're so worth the price if you can afford to buy a pair of jeans from them like they're they're probably like 90 bucks which is a little pricey for a pair of jeans, but they are so worth it. And one of their best selling jeans is the summer, what is it, the perfect summer jean. And every girl in my store has these jeans. Um, so I was like, do I like take the plunge? Do I get it? And I was like, no, I can't afford those jeans right now. So you know me, I always try to find like an alternative option, cheaper option that still is good. And I found the perfect pair. I don't have this color denim, so I was like, I need to get these. And they were on sale at American Eagle when I went. So I got the American Eagle mom jeans again. These, I love these. So I'm originally a size four, um, and I tried the size four on, they were a little big. Um, and then I tried to, tried a size two, and they fit okay, like a normal, like loose-ish mom jean, but I wanted a little bit tighter, like the summer jean fit. The summer jeans from Madewell are a little bit tighter, but still have the mom jean feel. And I wanted them to be a little bit more like tighter around like the waist and the butt area. So I went to a size zero and your girl has never been a size zero. And I was like, there's no way my cab is gonna even fit in these jeans. Put them on, they fit perfectly. So it's a little weird with sizing. So I would say go in the store and try them on um, and see what kind of fit you like better. But I'm originally a size four and I got these in a zero and I think they're just, they're perfect. I love the color. They're very similar to the, the Perfect Summer Jean from Madewell. I cuffed them at the bottom. Um, no rips in them, which I love because sometimes ripped jeans, I'm just not feeling a ripped jean. Um, they fit perfectly and these are probably one of my favorite pair of jeans that I own and I'm so happy I got them. I got them for 20 bucks. They're originally 30, I think, but I got them for 20 and I'm just, I love them. And then last but not least, I always every summer kind of try and pick up at least one bathing suit um, just because they're a staple and you're in bathing suit in the summer. Um, so I picked this bathing suit up a while ago um, and I picked it up because I needed like a family appropriate bathing suit. I'm um, not saying that like all my bathing suits, some of my bathing suits are like fairly inappropriate. They show a little bit more butt than usual. I like the cheeky style just because they're most flattering on me. Sometimes if they're full cut bathing suits, they just look like I'm wearing a diaper um, and I'm not really into that. Um, so I usually go for the more cheeky style bathing suits, but they're not very appropriate to wear around my family or my boyfriend's family or stuff like that. So I, I needed like a family appropriate bathing suit. Um, and this one is perfect and it's also a really good tanning bathing suit. So it is from the brand Triangle. Um, they've come a long way. Like I was never really a fan of the neoprene and they just came out with a ton of different styles and different feels and I'm obsessed with this one. I'm not exactly sure of what the name of the style is but I will link it down below for you guys. And it is just this white tube top. So again, this is perfect for tanning. Um, I got it in a size small. Um, it's amazing, I love it. It's not like neoprene, but it still kind of feels sturdy. I love this so much. And then the bottoms, they're just perfect, like very appropriate. They're still a little bit cheeky. I think I got the cheeky style, but their cheeky style isn't like excessive. Um, it's a little high-waisted. I'm pretty sure this was the high-waisted cheeky, which is what it's called. Um, I first of all love this color and second of all it's not like 
it's very appropriate on me. And then lastly, this was a freaking steal. I'm so happy I got this. So if you guys didn't know, Ari just had a sale. They usually do every year um, on their bathing suits. Everything was literally, I think like $20. Um, and I got this one piece for $20 and I'm so excited. It fits perfectly. I got it in a size small regular. They have different sizes. Um, but it's originally 44 and I got it for 20. Um, and I love the color. I just think it is so pretty for summer. Um, this one piece is perfect. It gives like the perfect, perfect side boob, I guess you could say. Not too much is hanging out, but it's still kind of, it's sexy, but like in a good modest way. I don't want my whole boob hanging out. No, no, no. Um, it's just very flattering and it's also slightly cheeky in the back. It's very cheeky. I probably wouldn't wear this around my family. Um, this is more of a vacation boyfriend bathing suit, but um, I love the low back and it's just, oh, it's such a beautiful one piece and I couldn't, I couldn't pass up $20 for this one piece. They have amazing one pieces and I highly recommend checking out Aerie um, for them because they just have really great high-waisted two-piece bathing suits as well. Like they had a ton um, and I would have got more, but I just didn't need them. But I saw this and I was like, I love this color. I've never seen this color before. I need it now. Like how beautiful is this color? Okay, so that is the end of my haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed everything that I share with you guys today. Um, again, I will leave everything linked down below in the description box, so it's very easy for you guys to shop the items. I cannot believe it's already, like, it's almost August. Like, the summer flew by so quickly, and it's almost, like, I, I went into one of the stores yesterday, and fall and Christmas stuff was already out, and I was like, oh my god. Like, I'm all for fall, but, like, Christmas is a little too soon. But pretty soon I'll be doing a fall clothing haul, and I'm very excited for it because it's my favorite. But yeah, if you guys did like this video, you guys do like me, don't forget to click the like button and then the subscribe button down below so you guys don't miss any more of my videos. And I will see you guys really soon. Bye!